Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another vlog. My name is Sid. I am a second year computer science major at Georgia Tech, and now it's final season. It's Wednesday, December 7th. My last final is Wednesday, December 14th, and that's the final I have to prep the most for. It's combinatorics. I have a low A in the class. I want to get an A in the class, which means I need an A on the final, which means I need to grind over the course of the next week. I have two other finals, but one of them is take home for my software design class and it's to be done with our group. And then one is for history and it's multiple choice. I'm not worried about either of those two, but I am worried about combinatorics. I also have a final assignment due on Friday for my cross-cultural studies class, which if you check out my last vlog, I already take the took the final four and I'm not too worried about that either. And today I have a presentation to attend for a project that we worked on throughout the semester relating to robotics, but my team leader is giving that, so I'm not too worried about that either. And there's going to be a lot of work to do over the course of the next week, but most of it is going to be centered around grinding for combinatorics. And I'm going to take you guys along with me. Let's get to it. All right, it's 12.30 now. I uploaded my vlog from yesterday and I also got half of my annotated bibliography done, so about five pages, eating a late breakfast of oatmeal. And I will get ready after this to go do my presentation and then I'll come back and finish up this annotated bibliography. All right, I just found out that I can actually attend the presentation online, which is great because I don't want to walk to where the presentation is then walk back and stay there for two hours. This way I can just stay here and then save time when it's time to make dinner and actually get back to working. So I'm going to attend the presentation on Zoom right now. I'll catch you guys after. Okay, so apparently there is no online meeting, which means I have to go in person, which means I'm late, which means I am running. I will see you guys later. Presentation meeting is done. It's 6.40 now. I ate dinner and I'm ready to go for round two of finishing this annotated bibliography. I won't stop until it's done. And then after that, I'll probably just watch YouTube and go to bed. So let's start session two right now. It is 8.20 and I just finished my annotated bibliography, which means I'm basically done with this class. Well, I do have to make a few final edits, but I'll go do that right now. After which I'll just relax, head to bed. And then when I wake up, I will start grinding combinatorics, which is the real demon of this exam season. So I will see you guys tomorrow morning. The deed has been done. I actually made a lot of grammar mistakes, so it took a lot longer to edit than I thought, but it is done and it is good. Good morning, it's Thursday. I slept a little late last night, which is why I woke up a little late, but I'm gonna head to the library right now and start studying for combinatorics. My main goal for today is just finish the first uh, exam portion. So basically everything that we covered up to the first exam and then retake the first exam. And then I think I'll be done with combo for the day and then I'll get some history revision under my belt. All right, let's go. I just got back from studying for combo in the library. I finished up what I had to get done today, which was one third of the portion, basically everything that was on exam one. So it's actually a little bit more than one third, but that's irrelevant. Right now, I'm gonna start reviewing history and just fill out a notion page with all the relevant information. Self-improvement still, because I mean, it's not really even a niche anymore. It's like yeah. channels. All right, I got some work done for history. I went through some of the slides. I'm feeling pretty good about what I've accomplished today exam-wise so far, but right now I have to go cook some dinner because it's 
4.30 and if I want to eat before 6, I got to start now because I have, don't have anything prepped. So I'm going to go do that and then I'll catch you guys after. It's Friday, it's 9 a.m. and I'm gonna start studying combinatorics skin right now. I'm gonna go for like a four hour study session, reworking old homeworks, after which I'll eat lunch and I will catch you guys then. All right, it's time to grind. All right, so I just finished study session number one for combo. I'm feeling a lot better now. I did a lot of problems, all the practice problems for exam two, some of the practice problems for the final, and I redid quite a few of our homework assignments. So I'm feeling pretty good now. I'm feeling a little bit more confident, but I have five days until the exam, so I have a lot of time to get to 100%. Right now, I'm just gonna eat some lunch and chill out, and then I'll get to studying history. Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good about my preparation for finals. I think my take-home exam will be released tonight and I'll be meeting with my group this weekend to work on that. And I don't think that should be a problem. It's take-home. It, we're working in a group. How hard can it really be? So it's looking to be pretty chill. But yeah, let me go eat. Ali, what do you have to say about finals? Bro, I hate multi, man. Bro, yeah, are those the exact words you used five seconds ago? No, I, I had to tone it down, you know? Like, I can't, like, I don't want these videos. Yeah, Yo, there you go. <laughs> he said that, not me. I'm actually yeah. not even taking multi this semester. Yeah, but I mean, you love the professor, right? No. Can you zoom in on his face? No, 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 no. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. It is 9.30 on Saturday. I'm feeling pretty good about everything right now, all things considered. I just relaxed yesterday at a friend's apartment and we just like hung out, did nothing really, did no studying. And today is gonna to be quite the opposite of that. I'm gonna get quite a lot of things done. I'm gonna finish a extra credit essay for history, even though I don't really need it, but you can never be too safe. Do a lot more combinatoric studying, hopefully get that entire portion done today so I can review more problems as the time comes. And then also just do a little bit of history studying to get ready for the exam on Monday, but again, not too stressed about that. So today is gonna to be pretty fun, let's go. All right, so I just got done with study session number one for combinatorics. I'm feeling pretty good. I got all the practice problems that a professor recommended done with and I reworked most of our assignments. Um, so I'm feeling good, I know where I stand, I know what I need to work on and I'll focus on that over the next few days as the exam gets closer. But for right now, I'm going to eat lunch. I didn't have time to make anything or I was too lazy to make anything. So I just made like sandwiches with turkey and cheese. Very basic. I'm going to eat this, watch a few YouTube videos, and then get ready for study session number two of the day where I'll be writing an essay for history for extra credit. All right, I just did some work for the final project for our 2340 class, which is our software design class. It's like a take home exam, not too bad. I did some of the problems for that for our group. I also wrote up my history extra credit paper and I got some combo studying to in today. So it's been pretty good and it is 5.51 p.m. So I still have a few more hours to get stuff done and, you know, just be really prepared for these exams. But as for now, I'm just gonna eat some Maggie. Horrible camera angle, but my throat is a little bit dead. So <clears throat> this will hopefully help with that and just taste good. And I'll chill out for a bit and then get back on that grind, revise my history notes. So I'm feeling really good for the exam on Monday. <laughs>
is now 5 p.m. I'm back in my room. I got some Chipotle to eat for dinner and I'm chilling, honestly. We finished the 2340 take home exam, so that's done. I finished studying for history and I printed out my extra credit essay, so that's done. Uh, my history exam is tomorrow at 8 a.m., by the way, so it's 5 p.m. I'm gonna go to sleep at 9, wake up nice and early, get rested, and go and take that exam. And I also got done studying for combo. Um, obviously, I will study for it after tomorrow or, or after tonight as well, but I think I'm taking the exam right now, I think I could get 100, but I will do some more studying anyways, just to be safe, because you know, what's there to lose? But I'm feeling really good about everything right now, so I'm just gonna relax for the rest of the night and eat some food. Alright, I finished my history exam. It's 8.53 a.m. on Monday. I'm done with history, so now all I have to do is study for combo for the last few days. Right now, I'm going to go put some laundry in the wash and then sit down and do a little bit of combo. I'm not super stressed about combo now that I did a bunch of work over the last few days. So I'm going to take it a little bit easier, but still do a bunch of problems, but not as focused as I've been the last few days. And I think it's going to go great. <laughs> studying for combo i ate my dinner i've done basically every problem in the textbook i think i am prepared for the exam now and i think i'm just going to chill out for the rest of the night and then grind again when it's tuesday which is tomorrow all right good morning everybody it is 24 hours before my exam it's 8 45 8 46 a.m on a tuesday i'm feeling pretty good about it to be honest i did every problem in the textbook which means there's really not much left for me to do except review the notes that we went over in class a little bit even though i've already done most of those and also go over some of the problems in the practice finals that she sent that weren't exactly recommended by our professor, which means I just need to spend a few more hours and I should be done and ready to ace this exam. Honestly, I feel like if I took the exam right now, I would do very well on it, but a little more prep never hurt anybody. So let's get to it. <laughs> did all the problems that were applicable in both practice finals. And now I think I'm officially done studying for combo. All I will do now is just review some of the notes at a leisurely pace because I really do feel like I'm prepared. I put in a ton of work over the last week as you've probably seen from the random time lapses and clips or whatnot. So I'm feeling pretty good. And the next time you guys will see me will probably be tomorrow, right before the exam. All right. We are on our way to our final. Hyped, very hyped. I'm hyped to get it over with. I don't know how it's going to go, but I think it'll be... I'm tired. Okay. He's tired. Roommates get loud, but all good. All right. We're about to ace this exam. Yeah. Sid right here is going to get 100. Yeah. I don't know about me, but we'll see. Yeah. We'll see how it goes. I just got done with the exam. I think it went all right. I'm actually pretty happy with it. There was one question, a proof question, where I wasn't exactly sure about my proof. I don't think it was the best, but I do think that I conveyed what I needed to convey to get an A. I'm feeling actually pretty good. So thank you guys so much for watching. That's final season, it's over. I'm gonna go and pack my bags and then head to the airport to catch a flight back home. But thank you guys so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button, leave a comment, share it with your friends. It would help me and the channel out a ton. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching again. I hope you have a great day. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.